In this video, I am so excited to be sharing with you a great way to be able to beat cover four quarters from the bunch tight end offense. What's up, guys? My name is Cody, and I want to thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch this YouTube video. Now, if you're new to the channel and you don't know what my channel is all about, my channel is all about how to become a better Madden player in Madden 21. I learn um, a lot about this game through studying other players, through practicing myself, and obviously through just kind of trial and error. And what I like to do on YouTube is kind of share some of the things that I'm learning with you. I'm not better than anybody else. I'm just practicing a lot and just wanted to share that with you. So um, if you are interested in subscribing, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. It's completely free. What subscribing does, it just allows you to know whenever we release new videos. All right, guys, so in today's video, what I wanted to take a look at here is a defense that I believe is gaining a lot of popularity in the community, and that is the cover four quarter style of defense. Um, I think that Zan might have been one of the first players in the community to be on top of this. Um, I know that I was kind of labbing it a little bit. Um, about a month or so, maybe maybe two months ago, and we have covered some significant amount of this style of defense in my 335 wide defensive ebook. But um, 335 has been the meta pretty much all season long. We've been running it since June, and it is the best defense in the game. Now, what a lot of people don't know is from the Cover 4 show, too, that is actually a Cover 4 quarters coverage. So you can basically run match coverage within your 335 wide. You have a Cover 3 match and a Cover 4 match in that in that um, in your arsenal. Now, the play that we're going to be using to attack this from the bunch tight end is the play curl flat corner. Now, if you guys have not already gotten my bunch tight end offensive ebook yet, it is, in my opinion, the best offense in the game. It is the most simple, the most consistent, and honestly, the most effective. And so, if you want to get a full uh, copy of that ebook, it's just 15 bucks. It's in the description um, for you. There's a link that you can click, and it'll take you right to the checkout if you want to get that. I also have a free sample of this full offensive scheme in my text message membership. The text message membership is completely free to you guys. All you got to do to sign up for it is just text me, and my number is in the top left-hand corner of your screen. Okay, guys, so the setup is relatively simple from Curl Flat Corner. What we're going to do is we're going to smart route triangle. Um, we're going to put square on a little out route, a five-yard out route. And we're going to streak tape on Austin. And then from on the back side of here, what I like to do is is I like to simply set up a couple, you can do a lot of different things. With match coverage, an option route to the running back is very effective for that. And then I either like to delay fade Robert Tunyon, or I could put Robert Tunyon on an out route or a streak. Any of those three options um, would be what I would recommend. Most of the time, I will put him on a delay drag, okay? And then from that point, all we're going to do, and this is the little trick. So if I run this play kind of stock, what I want you to watch here is if I run this stock, you're going to see that that corner route is going to basically bag... Um, or that corner back is going to bag the corner route, okay? That's kind of the whole point of cover four quarters um, from a defensive standpoint. Well, now I'm going to show you one little trick that's going to basically solve that problem. The trick is to simply motion out Valdez Scantling. Whenever you motion him out, it essentially turns the formation into a trips tight end look. And what you're going to see is going to happen is this cornerback on the outside is going to squat down onto that guy right there, leaving Devontae Adams pretty much wide open um, to do whatever he wants to do. That is a very, very easy way to take care of this. Now, one of the adjustments that a lot of people will make out of cover four quarters, I would be um, ignorant if I didn't tell you this. One of the other adjustments that you will see a lot of people make, really quickly, I want to show you one other little piece of this. So, again, if I motion this through and, and, and do all of this, what you're going to see is that safety on the left side should take Devontae Adams, and that's going to leave circle up the top for a one-play touchdown over the top against cover four quarters. As you can see right there, completely wide open and very difficult to defend. So because of that reality, what a lot of people are going to do is they're going to take this cornerback or this safety on the left side and they're going to put him um, into a deep half. And again, the reason I like the bunch tight end so much is because it causes so many alignment issues. It kind of combines trips tight end and bunch into one formation. But what you're going to notice here is if I motion out as scaling out, you're going to see that that deep half adjustment is going to make this corner route open for about 30 to 45 yards down the, the line of the, the line to gain. The other thing that you're going to notice about this is you do have a window to be able to try to hit this route to Tavon Austin, um, especially if you streak the tight end. So if you streak the tight end, what you're going to see happen is the, the corners on the right side are going to have to deal with him. 
And then as you see here, now you just can basically drive a truck through. And if you get a nice swerve catch, that could potentially be a one-play touchdown against that cover four-quarter style of defense. The last thing that I wanted to talk to you about really quickly here as far as it pertains to some adjustments that people will make out of cover four quarters is – if they take this safety on the left side and they put him into an inside third. Now this is another common adjustment to kind of deal with the streak problem that Tavon Austin is going to pose. The problem is it doesn't deal with the rest of the issue. Um, the major issue to me is the fact that this cornerback on the left side squats. And as you see here, now again, pass lead that up. And that's another one play touchdown over the top of cover four quarters. So in my opinion, cover four quarters is not something that you want to consistently run against the bunch tight end. There's a lot of problems with it when it, when it contains to how it deals with some of these things. Now, obviously, if you can get really adjusted out of your cover four quarters, that's one thing. But if they're using this motion out tactic, you're going to have a lot, a lot of trouble uh, with your cover four quarters, especially if they've got good user stick and they can make swerve catches just like that. So... If you want to get the full ebook on Bunch Tight End, it shows you how to literally beat every single defense in the game that somebody can throw to you. Um, throw at you. You have the routes, you have the scheme. Now all you got to do is go out and execute it. So that's kind of the, the strategy with the ebook there. It shows you everything that I know about the offense and also everything that I've picked up along the way. So if you want to get that full ebook, that is in the description. Thank you so much for your time today. I hope you enjoyed the video, and we will see you on our live stream tonight at 10 o'clock, and you can see me run this against my subscribers and see just how lethal this offense really, really is. Thank you for your time, and if you have any questions about the ebook, feel free to text me or any questions about Madden in general. You can always hit me up via text. Just a quick reminder, the link to the ebook is available for you in the description.